What's going on guys, Boshman Arkham City, and today I am angry, I am very angry, but before I get to that I have to say a massive, massive thank you to Optic Midnight for putting me on her Duel Me Duel Com series on her channel the other day, it was amazing, I had so much fun uh, recording a commentary with her, and it's been incredible, the, the, the response, and yeah, thank you to her, if you want to be on the next Duel Me, you can leave a like and a comment on her video. And you could be the next person, because I never expected it. <laughs> I left one comment saying I'd like to do a dual com, and she picked me. So, this goes to show that you can only have, to, only have to leave one comment and something great can happen. So, yeah, a big thank you to her. Go check out the video. It was awesome. So, now I am very angry. <laughs> and I'm angry at YouTubers. Small YouTubers. What the fuck is going on? Seriously, what is all this talk I'm hearing? Why do you feel entitled to a shout out? What is going on? I have, when I started my channel, I never once expected anyone to help me. I never once expected people like Wicked Shrapnel to put me on Sub Sunday or Optic Midnight to put me on Duel Me or anything like that. I just wanted to make videos for people. What is this obsession with becoming famous? Why? Why does it matter? It's YouTube. It's not like it has any bearing on the real world. <laughs> I never started my channel to become a machinima director. I never started my channel to become the next Woody's Gamertag or the next Hutch or the next CNANAS or anything like that. I started making videos because I like making videos. I started my channel because I wanted to tell people my opinions. I'm not good at talking in actual conversations. <laughs> it's, this is a way for me to express my opinion, a way for me to express myself that I can't do to face-to-face -to -face people because I'm not that social. <laughs> it's a lot easier for me to make a video like this than it is to go up to some random in the street and say, hey, how you going? Can we talk about fucking Call of Duty or anything like that, you know? So, I just get so riled up when I see this this, this whole, like, fucking self-entitlement. That's what it is. It's like, well, if someone like Woody's Gamertag can get famous off it, why, I deserve it too, you know? I should... I should have that, you know, and it's not, it's not the case. <laughs> it's just not the case. It's, it's like Wicked Shrapnel said the other day in his video, he said, I'm not going to support channels that don't support me. And I couldn't agree more with that statement. That is just, that is just the center of the argument here. It's just the, the boiled down, like, raw center of the argument. And that's the thing, like, you see these channels, they, they post a video and they think, well, I'm going to be famous. That's, Excuse me, that is not the case. That is definitely not the case. <laughs> you know, they, they post this fucking shitty dazzle commentary with like... Fucking crazy blurriness and it's like... Hey, I'm playing Sea town and... I'm using a shotgun USAS-12 and... I'm playing with friends and... Um... Yeah. And... Yeah, it just... It rolls me up to think that these guys think that they deserve something. You know, like, you don't deserve anything. You should need to go, when you, if you're going to start a YouTube channel like a gaming channel like this, you need to go into it expecting nothing. There are so many people doing it. The market is so saturated right now. You really need to go into it and expect nothing. Like, I, when I started, I never expected 10 subscribers, let alone 739. Or whatever it is now. It's, it's insane. So... You know, you gotta, you really, really gotta go into it thinking that, you know, it's not gonna, it's not gonna do anything because, you know, you can go into it and work hard and get somewhere like I have. You know, I worked hard on my videos and Wicked Trapnel took notice. You know, I put a lot of effort into my sub Sunday submission, and he recognised that and he posted it on his channel. It's as simple as that. Like, I never expected him to 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 like and comment on my videos and to even put me on sub Sunday. I like, I never expect, I never said to him, you know. Put me on Sub Sunday. <laughs> Don't be a dick. Put me on Sub Sunday. I never said anything like that, you know? And when he put it on there, I was grateful, you know? It was amazing. I messaged him. I said, thanks so much for putting me on Sub Sunday, you know? Thanks so much for liking my video. Thanks so much for commenting, you know? I don't ex expect him just to comment and and then not me not say anything, you know? I am so utterly grateful for Wicked Travel's support on my channel that, you know, I wouldn't have a channel if he wasn't, if he wasn't around, so... You know, th this whole idea that big YouTubers don't help small YouTubers enough is 
is ridiculous. This whole idea that you deserve a shout out, that you deserve to to get a like from someone like Wiki Trap and all Woody's Game Attack is absurd. Absolutely absurd, you know? And then when you go and make a video about it, <laughs> how Wicked Trap and all of Woody's Game Attack or whoever didn't make a video uh, didn't make a video about you or didn't like your video or didn't give you a dual com or a shout out. It makes everyone in the in the small YouTube community look like a bunch of whiny little girls that can't do anything for themselves. And we all know that that is not the case 100% of the time, you know? Obviously there's a small select group of people that are ruining the smaller YouTube's uh, reputation, I guess you could say. Uh, but, you know, <laughs> it's just, uh, it's ridiculous. It really, really is. And this whole notion that you deserve to be famous on YouTube, it's not it's not how you should go about things when you make a YouTube channel. When you make a YouTube channel, you should be doing it for the fun of it. That's what I do. I have fun making these videos. This particular video isn't very fun because I'm angry. <laughs> I don't like being angry in videos because that's not who I am. I'm not an angry person, but when there's people out there making me look bad because they are pathetic and they don't want to do any work for, for, for any like sort of success whatsoever, it, it really just riles me up and you think about it in the real world, like you can't go to a job and do nothing and get a promotion. You have to work. You can't, you know, you can't fucking, exactly, <laughs> that's it, you can't work in a job and expect to get a promotion while doing nothing. That's the best possible way I can put it. YouTube is exactly the same. If you want something from YouTube, you have to work for it. You can't go into it expecting riches. You can't go into it expecting to be famous. So, I don't know. I'm just fucking rambling. I fucking hate this, that people do this, but it happens. Nothing I can do about it. Anyway, leave your thoughts in the comments below. I'll be sure to read every single one. I'll thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later.